Funny to see. I could never imagine them goddamn things jumping on you. <laughs> yeah, Jake's got them over there too. He's got I can say, set. knock on wood. Now, got these junky ass neighbors over there, but knock on wood, I haven't ever had a problem with mice. I haven't had a problem with any kind of bugs other than them little beetle bugs and the fucking stink bugs this summer. But then them spiders last year, oh, I told Matt, I said, we're either getting something to get rid of these spiders or we're moving because I said, I can't deal with yeah, these mice. spiders. Yeah, mice. I got them mice. Dick's got them just as bad as me. Every, every winter, Dick says the same thing. They're in there. He said them, I was sitting here last, uh, yeah, last night. They, what they do, you can hear them. They sneak in behind that moisture in there and they get in Bella's food in there. They get these big old pieces of food out and sitting in there lunching away. You can hear them. I'm like, God damn, that, that little son of a bitch, and he's in there in that goddamn bowl of food. Well, pretty soon he must went back the other way with a big old kernel of that damn food. Smack! I said, Daddy, that mouse trap went off. Daddy, there was another one. I bet we done caught 15 of them. Same way over there at Jake's. And some bitches over there, I don't know where the hell it's coming from over there at Jake's. That could be anywhere. I mean, if it gets, once it gets cold outside, they're looking for a warm place with food. 
That just, I tell you what, when I, well, I, I want clean, clean food, buddy. Well, that's why I'm a big germaphobe. Yeah. Like, there's patients, families out there that try to bring shit in. I'm like, I ain't eating none of that shit unless I know where it come from. Set around and set the John damn ass. They've got cockroaches, bugs, or rats, or what in their house, and you want to sit there and eat that shit they brought in? Uh-uh, no thanks. I'm like my mom, when you go in there and cook, she always put this apron on and wash her hands, and she's a clean cook, too. And I tell you what, buddy, like Rudy said, you can go over there and eat any damn thing. I'm the same well, I know way. I cook, and I bet you I wash my yeah, hands half a dozen I do, times too. I do, too. I do, too. I get something on my hands, I'll wash my yeah. hands. Yeah. I just can't. Goddamn and person. If I get a little stuff on the counter, I wipe yeah, it Yeah, I, I do that. I got I, If I get make something and it's laying there on my counter or wash my hands, get the rag, wipe it up and shit, yeah. And I, I can't I can't handle someone sitting around mass picking her toes and digging her toe jams out and everything else. Ooh, that's, that is so goddamn nasty. Sitting there going... <laughs> Well, not even so much as that. If I'm a little sketchy about your house to begin with, I yeah. so I ain't gonna not eat nothing you cook. No. Because if your house looks like a damn city dump, most likely you're not being very clean when you're cooking either. Yeah, and you don't either that or either sit in there and eat ten day old chicken that's been sitting in the refrigerator for ten days. Yeah. Like